whose refusal to accept Virginia's ban on interracial marriage led to a Supreme Court ruling in 1967 that struck down similar laws across the nation. The Loving versus Virginia decision overturned long-standing legal and social prohibitions. The case demonstrated how a young, small-town black and white couple changed history. Her story. History. Your story? My story. Their story. Our story. According to the U.S. Census Bureau, there are 4.3 million interracial couples in the nation. That, that wasn't, wasn't true, true in, in 19... 19... That wasn't true. That wasn't in... true in 19... That, that wasn't, wasn't true, true in 1958, 1958 when, when childhood sweethearts, sweethearts Mildred and Richard drove 90 miles north to Washington, D.C., where they could legally be wed. Mildred didn't realize that it wasn't legal for a black woman and a white man to wed. They thought if they were married, they wouldn't be bothered. <laughs> <laughs> but when they returned to Virginia, somebody called the law. Whose law? His law. Her law. Your law. My law. Their law. Our law. Out law. In law. Red law. Blue law. White law. Black law. Gay law. Straight law. LGBTQ law. Ba la 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 law. The sheriff roasted them out of their bed at 2 a.m. in July 1958. He told them their DC marriage was no good. No good. Uh, no good in Virginia. He took them to jail. He charged them with unlawful cohabitation. They pleaded guilty? Guilty. The judge sentenced them to a year in jail to be suspended if they left the state for 25 years. 